Hi everybody, I'm Jax Fry. I'm a Louisiana artist and author. So we're all quarantined and by now everyone has cut their lawns and changed the batteries in the smoke detectors and been binge watched 10 hours of Netflix at least, right? So now what? Well, before I make a suggestion, let me tell you a tiny bit about my business. As many of you, of you know, I paint highly textured Louisiana art. I'm best known for these mini paintings and gift items with, uh, with Louisiana images that people love to collect. I sell online and through many stores and galleries, and I do custom mini paintings and corporate event gifts as well. The website for the art is artbyjacks.com. Uh, so last year, something new happened in my business. It was exciting. One of the images I like to paint is of these women, and I call them the Gumbo Sisters. One day I realized that the sisters had a story to tell uh, because they're, they're joyful and strong and supportive and they love their Louisiana life. It reminded me of some of my friends. So I decided to write the story. And every afternoon I'd go to St. John's Coffee House and, uh, and work on it. Then in October of last year, I launched the book, here it is, uh, The Gumbo Sisters, and I set it loose. So it's available in Kindle and paperback on Amazon and signed, you can get signed copies at my website at gumbosisters.com. Notice the spelling. Uh, so now if you're looking for something to entertain you during our downtime, the Gumbo Sisters might just be the ticket. Here's what the book is about. When one of the sisters unfairly loses her job to a smarmy do-nothing replacement, five fiery southern women rise up and wage a war to try and get it back for her. They use their improbable friendships, evil genius schemes, oh so many cocktails, and many get-togethers, which included eating, eating lots of gumbo, to figure out how to solve their sister's problems once and for all uh, in the oddest way possible. The book has many twists and laugh out loud moments as well as some uh, heart-wrenching ones too. The novel is set in Covington and New Louisiana and New Orleans, um, two of my favorite places, so it was easy to write for me. Uh, much to my surprise, the book has gotten uh, some really nice reviews and honors as well. Um, it was chosen as one of the official book selections uh, for 2020 by the biggest book club in the world, the Pulpwood Queens. Um, well, so then things really took off and I guess I had to admit, well, I suppose I'm in the book business too now. Um, I enjoyed writing the novels and many people requested more about the sisters. So I have spent my uh, self-isolation um, so far in finishing up the second book for the sisters and it's called The Gumbo Sisters, Many Flavors of Love. It should be out in a couple of months and I'll do a pre-order on Amazon. Um, but if you'd like to be no notified about when that book is going to be released, uh, please go to gumbosisters.com and sign up for the newsletter and there's a free gift waiting for you there if you do. So that's what I'm doing these crazy days and that's my business in a nutshell. The sisters and I hope you are staying home and staying safe. I love you all. Thanks for watching and we'll meet up again at the Southern Hotel soon. Take care.